I'm like way too excited about getting Taco Bell. Hey guys, welcome back or welcome to my channel if you're new. I'm so excited. Today, obviously you can tell by the title, we're trying the new Grande, Grande Stacker $5 box with their, well, it's not even new because I was watching videos and apparently this was part of like their, JC's in the back and I swear she does this the whole time, but it was part of like their $1 menu which they have it now and it's not even a dollar to get it by itself it's like I don't even know a couple of dollars but then they have like the five dollar box where you get two tacos and a drink which is what I did and I also thought that it came with a large drink but maybe not I don't know anyways so that's what I got I also got a chalupa so this is the box and then I got a chalupa just because I freaking have not had a chalupa in a long time. And that's like my favorite thing to get from Taco Bell. So, I'm doing a little mukbang, mukbang. I always say it mukbang. But everyone I hear like says mukbang. I don't know how to say it. Anyways, we're going to be eating some good food. I'm so excited. I know some people probably think this is weird, but I absolutely love watching videos of people eating. I don't know what it is, but I love it. <laughs> it's so like satisfying. So we're gonna we're gonna jump in and try this new item. I got Baja Blast. It's so good. JC is eating veggie straws in the back. If you guys are curious, because I knew she would not be quiet just sitting here. But she's eating lunch when we get home. It's pretty early. It's only like 11 o'clock. But I'm doing a grocery pickup after this because Taco Bell's on the way. So it works out. So we're going to start off with the stacker. It's basically like a beef quesadilla, like folded. I feel like I'm just going to make a mess. So here it is just like folded quesadilla. I better get napkins ready. Okay, there's already like stuff spewing out of it. So I think it's just beef, nacho cheese, and shredded cheese. So, I mean, I don't know how it could be bad, but. It's good. I usually like my stuff with like veggies and whatnot. So like, this is just meat and cheese, which is good. I mean, everything at Taco Bell is good and it's pretty much all the same, but. Yeah, I mean, it was good. Nothing crazy. Definitely like Chalupa is the number one item. I have a story time for you guys. All that cheesy goodness. I do say, anything with nacho cheese on it, yum. So, This story time took place approximately 15 minutes ago, right before I left my house. So me and Jay-Z were just chilling, and all of a sudden I hear a knock on the door, which, you know, nowadays, unless you expect someone, like, or expecting somebody to be stopping by, someone to, like, randomly knock on your door is a little bit out of the ordinary now. <laughs> so I was like, what the heck? I thought maybe it was a package I hadn't ordered anything I'm not expecting anything I look outside because like you know being a woman I'm not just gonna open the door for anybody so I look outside I don't see anybody like any extra cars so I was like uh eh, you know it's the middle of the day what the heck it's a Monday 
So I'll like peek out my, my door has like a window on top. So I peek out just, you know, I always check. That's what I always do no matter what. And it was a cop. So I was like, well, I'm gonna answer if it's a cop, you know, maybe something is going on. And apparently they got like a, a call but like no one was talking and it sounded like a toddler and I'm like shoot because JC was playing with my phone I'm like did she somehow dial 911 but they said they like had to track the number because obviously like nobody was talking and I don't think they can they must not be able to like pinpoint specifically but he said it it like came from my address but it could have been off and he did say that <sighs> They had somebody like a block away. I don't know if this has happened before. So maybe a house like a block away. They have kids too. But I went and I like checked my phone while he was still there. And I didn't have any outgoing calls. So like if she would have dialed it somehow. Like it would have showed up there. And she was watching like videos or like listening to music. So like I would have heard the the sound stop if she would have actually like dialed out you know so it was just really weird the cop was really nice though but I was like yeah I checked my phone I was like yeah there's no I don't have any outgoing calls from today and like this is like <clears throat> our only phone my husband's home but he's sleeping he works nights So I'm like, I have no idea. It's like another car parked kind of by me. Probably doing the same thing, eating in their car. But I was just like, hmm, I don't know. It wasn't, it didn't come from our house, which is weird that it would have like pinged like the signal or whatever, how they do that, that it like came from our house. I was like, that's really weird because she was on my phone. So I was like, but she's never, for her, like she's not even two years old. For, like the odds of her actually dialing 911 and then like completing and like sending the call are very, very low. <laughs> like there's no way she would have been able to do that. She just dumped all of her veggie straws out. That's gonna be fun to clean up. So that's my little story time. It's getting kind of messy. I love Taco Bell. If any of my friends and family, you know me personally, you know I love tacos. I love Taco Bell. This is literally, <laughs> this is so messy. I didn't think it'd be this bad. But can we talk about the fact that Taco Bell's menu, I feel like has kind of really gone downhill like if you <clears throat> follow them if you eat here often you know that they've removed a ton of items recently which is super annoying because they took off all of the items with potatoes which I love their fiesta potatoes it was just like a little side dish with sour cream and nacho cheese and then their potato griller was one of my favorite things to get and a lot of people are mad about the potatoes because like if you're a vegan or like a vegetarian <laughs> you always got potatoes instead of meat and then last time i was here i tried their i don't remember what it's called because i feel like they didn't have it very long 
it was like that hard shell taco but then it was wrapped in a soft shell taco and I think it had like maybe some nacho cheese in it but it was on their dollar menu so it was only a dollar it was so good I was so excited to get it again and I looked and they took it off their menu already and they always do that I feel like they're always bringing in new items and taking them off in like a couple weeks I don't know. I love Taco Bell, but I know for a fact that they're making a lot of people mad by doing that. But I think I read somewhere that they're doing it to try to like simplify their menu, which I don't know. Another big fan favorite, which I had tried one time, is their quesarito. And they still have it where you can order it, like you have to do the online. So I came here one time <laughs> wanting to try it and I went through the drive-thru and the lady's like, oh, like we have it, but you have to do the online order. Like that doesn't make any sense. So I literally was like, so I can go do the online order and then come back to get it and then come back to get it and she's like yeah and I'm like why can't I just order it through the drive through why do I have to go order it online like you have it you can make it I'm like that doesn't make any sense and I know the quesarito I think that's what it's called is like a lot of people's favorite thing which I tried it and I'm not like a huge fan of it again I like my veggies that's why I like the chalupa so much but I mean it was good Food makes me so happy. I'm not even ashamed. Like, I love food. I'll never be a girl that goes on a diet unless my doctor's like, you're gonna die if you don't stop eating like that. I don't even eat bad. Like, we don't eat fast food. A lot of the times, if we go out to eat, it's like Subway. So you get two tacos in your box and I did get soft shell because I mean I'd eat hard shell but I prefer a soft shell taco they're just a lot less messy so I feel like hard shells they just get everywhere <clears throat> I kind of have a little bit of a cold so if I sound stuffed up that's why it's not too bad though I feel like when I was growing up, that's all I would get is soft shell tacos. Like before I, like when I was a kid, that was my go-to. Just get soft shell. I always watch these videos like these mukbangs at night so it'll be like 11 o'clock at night and I'm starving watching people eat Taco Bell or McDonald's or whatever and I'm like why do I do this to myself every time <laughs> JC's in the back just spazzing out Yeah, I know. I eat from like both sides of my taco. Comment below if you do that because I'm pretty sure my husband makes fun of me for doing that. I've always done it. I don't know why. 
because I feel like, oh, the middle's the best part and that'll be my last bite. I think that's my logic. That's what runs through my head. I might save my other soft shell for later. I feel like JC's starting to freak out a little bit. We have to go pick up groceries after this. Otherwise, we're not doing a whole lot today. Aw. We should drop a lot of this. <clears throat> my favorite chalupa. The chalupa. It's gonna make a mess, but that's okay. It's kind of cold. Ooh. Like, I haven't been sitting here that long, but whatever. Mm. Mm. Oh, yeah! It's so good every time. Taco Bell. And it sucks because my husband likes Taco John's better. Yeah, I don't know what's wrong with him. But I'm a Taco Bell gal. Mm. It's like really crunchy on the bottom. So I actually used to work at Culver's when I was in high school and college. I worked there for five years and it was really, it's a good job, obviously. Like they paid really well, loved the people. I worked with there. Good time, fun fact. I live next door to to a couple, and they both worked at Culver's. So kind of the best neighbors. But I would love to do like a Culver's mukbang and do like a story time. I don't really have anything too crazy that ever happened to me. Just like weird. You know, weird customers. If you've worked in fast food, you know. Like, there's always some weird <laughs> people. And I'll have to, like, really rack my brain because it's been a while since I worked there. But I bet I can think of some weird stuff. Me and my neighbors are actually just talking about how we kind of, like, miss working there. Like, miss working with the people. Hopefully you guys can't hear her too much. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna get going because Jaycee's losing her mind back there. But make sure you guys are subscribed. Go ahead and give this video a like. It really does help my channel. I promise I don't just say these things to say them. So... So make sure you give it a like and there subscribe to my channel for more videos. I hope you guys enjoyed watching and I'll see you next time. <laughs>